Hello, everybody. This is Scott, and he's really nice looking. And there's Steven. Okay, get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Go away. Well, today I'm going to show you how to make gold with, with, with cracked and stuff. So, this is called cracked gold or gold crack. Um, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to the text f uh, text tool. You're gonna switch that to white, and you're gonna type in gold. But I don't really want it to be white. So I go to the little thing right here. And we're going to make it yellow because, you know, gold's yellow. Um, but we're going to start like that. And what we're going to do is, and I'm just showing, this is really the only thing you really need to do um, with that. But what I did with this to get this little effect with the gold, like the, the Peter Jackson gold thing going on here, the, the Percy Jackson, um, what you're going to do is you're going to go and right click and go to blending properties. And um, what you're going to do is you're going to go to bevel and emboss. And I sort of messed around with this because, see, before I, oh, I also put a little gradient overlay on it. But you don't want to be too opaque. Um, you want it to be about 50 percent, <laughs> about fifty percent opacity, um, because you don't want all the. Because if you, if that doesn't look like gold, that looks like a sunset over the it beach. But um, <laughs> if you want it to be like that, that's not. No, nah, it's not too opaque. Um, okay, but you go to <laughs> you go to bevel and emboss. And what you're going to do is you're going to turn the size to about 11. Because if, if you turn it up big, it's going to look retarded. Um, oh, I'm sorry. That was offensive. Um, su subscribe. Um, <laughs> but um, you're going to go to inner bevel <laughs> instead of outer. <laughs> this outer looks like that. That doesn't look like gold. Uh, you want it to be inner bevel and you want it to be smooth. You don't want it to be chisel hard. Because, well, you can put it chisel hard if you want. It's really to your own likeness. Um, that looks sort of metallic -y, though. Um, so I kept it like this to make it look sort of goldy. Um, size 20 something, make it like that. Don't mess with this. You can mess with the angle if you want, because, well, not too much, not like that. But that's sort of just where the lights reflect, refracting. And um, opacity, all this stuff. That's just how I did it. Um, and then what I did was, since gold glows, um, they both start with G, um, and they have three. Uh, L O, and uh, so I made it glow, and uh, I could have easily done this in the same uh, layer, but I didn't. Um, so the, all I did with this is I, and this is behind it, obviously, since it's underneath. Um, but all I did was do outer glow and turn it to this. I don't, because this sort of looks too gold. It just doesn't look great. That sort of gives it a little bit of a glow, but not too much. It sort of doesn't overpower the goldness. Um, but that's how you make a really generic looking gold thing for your local golden jewelry store. There you go. Oh my God, I hate that. Subscribe. Subscribe, comment, and we thumbs up. Rick.